Vice President Kamala Harris is not ruling out consequences from the United States should Israel continue with its plans to expand its military operations into the city of Rafah as part of the ongoing war against Hamas. Harris spoke with ABC News, reaffirming the Biden administration's stance against a Rafah invasion. We have been clear in multiple conversations and in every way that any major military operation in Rafah would be a huge mistake. Let me tell you something. I have studied the maps. There's nowhere for those folks to go. The United Nations reports over one million people are living in the border city, with most having been displaced from other parts of the territory due to the conflict. Despite U.S. disapproval, Israeli Prime Minister Benjamin Netanyahu has been undeterred in a planned attack in Rafah as recently as last night, saying it is necessary in order to defeat Hamas. The Israeli defense minister and a separate Israeli delegation are visiting Washington this week to meet with top U.S. officials concerning the war in Gaza and plans for Rafah.